So far till now we have saw the basic example of the level. Now we will go with you know, the type of exchanges. See, exchanges is nothing what happens is when you try to send a message right from producer to broker and then the broker sends a message to the consumer right. So it may be a possibility that there may be many consumers right subscribe to your message. But not every time you may be intending to send the message you need to you know, put down some filtering cases you need to put down some routing cases right right in a, in the middle so that the message gets transcripted accordingly to the logic you have defined for your message execution and transmission right so let's start with the type of exchanges see exchange is nothing but it's a control for routing the message within the queue as i said let's give a simple formal example right there are a list of students right that are subscribed to a particular examination result but the result should only be, go, be given to the students who are passed out right so I need to filter my message based on the routing key that is there is pass or fail right right so what I will do is I will put down the key is equals to pass and the message should be transmitted only to the students who are passed out in the examination right we will see on the basis of the figure that how exactly things work on so first thing is direct exchange. Direct exchange is, is a very simple thing that you have many number of queues subscribed, right? As we see in the figure, that you have many number of queues subscribed for your message and the message should be sent only to the particular queue basis of the routing key. We can see here a producer. We can see the producer what he does is he sets a key value with green and what exactly happens after setting the value green is the message is being transformed to the queue that contains the key as a green. So, when you want to send a message to very unique persons within the number of subscribe, you know, organizers of the queue, only at that point of time you can use the direct exchange. The another form of exchange to send the message is fan out exchange. Right. The fan out exchange is used to route the messages, right? All kind of queues indiscriminately. What happens exactly is if a routing key is provided, it will simply be ignored, right? Because here we can see, we, we can see in the previous figure in the direct thing that only the message is being sent to the green on the basis of the queue. And here we can see that the message is broadcasted among all the available queues that are subscribed for the message means if I want to send the result to every student no matter whatever the result is, result is equals to pass or result equals to fail nothing but when I want to broadcast my message at that point of time I will be using the fan out exchange kind of scenario because I need to send my message to multiple recipients on the same time right so this is the best method to you know broadcast your message among the multiple uh, you know recipients that have been subscribed to your queue Fair enough. The another form of message is topic exchange. Topic exchange is what we, we saw in the direct exchange that we can write only one key value and the message goes to the one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. So it's kind of one-on-one -on -one interaction in the uh, entire message communication, right? What happens when I want to send the message to green and orange and not to the red? So in that form of practical case, you need to go on with the topic exchange. What you have to do is you have to write the multiple key values. As we can see here, producer and a form of message, what is trying to be sent, right? What then happens is the message is being transformed, right? With, with the routing key values that may be either green, that may be either first, last. See, the, the message value can be anything. The key can be anything. What here they are trying to do is they are only sending the messages to the green and fast the red dust fast is ignored as, as we can even see the line of message being consumed from here see we can see it goes to the green it goes to the red we can see the value the green dot fast so it is fast and it is green they are being subscribed for the message all the three are subscribed for the method of the message but measure to be based on this condition router on basis of this condition it's called topic right so far we have seen the three types of scenarios, right? So, so 
what can be the more detailed explanation for the, such kind of scenarios? Let us understand that and, and then let us then move on to the practical explanation of this scenario so what exactly happens in the, when we are going through the live environment of such examples, right?